After going years without answers, Felicia Cox's loved ones laid her to rest today. Cox's family and friends held a funeral at the Tudor Memorial Funeral Home. Felicia's cousin Tina Shaw said her remains were wrapped in a purple cloth, which was her favorite color. Anthropologists and archaeologists found Felicia's body earlier this month. The remains were buried about five feet in front of a home on Cane Creek Road just west of Pontotoc. David Neal Cox, who owned the home, was the last person seen with Felicia in July 2007. Cox sent a letter and a map of where he buried his sister-in-law before his execution last month for the murder of his estranged wife. Shaw said it means so much to her family to finally have some closure after 14 years. Relief, mm -hmm. I guess you could say relief, um, wouldn't you think? Mm -hmm. It's, um, you know, when you go through 14 years of wondering, you know, and waiting, waiting, wondering. So yeah, it's, it's, it's relief. It's more peace now. Felicia's killer, David Neal Cox, was the first inmate executed in Mississippi in nine.